This time the Lions 0-10 because they knocked the Bears out of first place. Here we go from Soldier Field. 72nd straight year these two teams playing. Brian Erlacher doesn't remember when they met in 1930, but he's going to be around for a long time. Charlie Batts, play fake. And you know, it's a time of year that you see a wonderful, wonderful life starring Jimmy Stewart. And here's James Stewart after the cameraman was fake. It's a wonderful play of 56 yards. And then on the same drive, it's Stewart again, so he's been back two games. Wait a minute, 0-10 Detroit up, 7-0 at first place Chicago at Soldier Field. Third quarter at 10-3 Detroit and Mike Brown. Too quick for Johnny on the spot with not a safety. Tackle at the one of He has such tremendous timing down around the line of scrimmage here on his blitzes in the red zone. He just is one of those guys around the football. You saw Batchley with a separated right shoulder. David Terrell, not a good day for him. Jim Miller wide open. Terrell looking more like Marvin Gaye and Tammy Terrell. And then there ain't no mountain high enough, but the goalpost isn't even high enough for Terrell. But no. And how about wide receivers coach Todd Haley? The job of the receiver is Maybe. to catch the ball. <laughs> Bears down 10 6, though, fourth quarter, so you know what's going to happen. You know what's going to happen. Leon Johnson, they dust him off for a first down. And then Miller to the big play guy, Marty Booker. So they've won at Tampa, they've won at Minnesota, all of a sudden they're struggling against Detroit, but no more. Johnson to the goal line, touchdown! Touchdown! The Bears. They did 13 10. Jim McMahon once owned this stadium. And Detroit Trimble. Well, not Jim McMahon, it's rookie Mike McMahon from Rutgers. Good job, Tom. Two minutes left in the game, second and four. McMahon, it looked pretty good on Thanksgiving. And Jimmy scored. It's your first down. Kicker Jason Hansen, normally very good. He'd only missed about three field goals going into the game, but he missed two earlier. Would he have a chance? McMahon to Larry Foster. Down to the 22. It's a first down. Timeout. Hansen. 40-yard field goal. Oh, man, not even close. No mulligans allowed. His third miss of the day, Dick Geron. Matt Millen. Oh. Matt, uh, did not, did not around many teams like this. Not that he was involved with, I can tell you that. The Lions fall to 0-11, just the seventh team since the merger. To start 0-11, and the Bears... 13-10, another late win at Soldier Field. Yeah, and I think we certainly know who the Bears are now. The offensive game plan is to not make mistakes. The throws are made close to the line of scrimmage within five or ten yards on, on either side. Today, I think the deepest pass they threw, Marty Booker, about 20 yards down the football field. Lions last day losses by a total of 35 points, but guess what? They're 0-11, and it's not going to get any better.